Ciao, everybody. Tom Kelly with August Wine Group and Small Vineyards here. Today, we're in the Mission District of San Francisco to talk about one of our favorite affordable wines from southern Italy, the Palama Silice Salentino. For this wine, we're dropping way down on the heel of Italy's boot to the Salento Peninsula, a town called Lecce, with its red rock topsoils, constant wind, and Mediterranean climate. Thick-skinned ancient grapes grow in this region, like Primitivo and its genetic cousin, Negromaro. Like almost all Silice Salentinos, this one is 80% Negromaro and 20% Malvasia Nera. A lot of people know this wine by its nickname, Archangelo, that appears on the front of every bottle. Winemaker Nini Palama and his father, Archangelo, made wine together for years. And his father, like so many of the World War II generation, was really excited to know that the wines were going to reach U.S. soil. But sadly, he passed away shortly before that happened. As a celebration of his dad's life, he decided to put Archangelo on the front of every label. In Puglia, there's very little topsoil. It's actually more about a sheath of red rock, about three meters deep, that the roots have to penetrate before they ever find sand and soil. Even in this hot Mediterranean climate, you typically have to dry farm. So you have five years, longer than any other DOC in Italy, to irrigate your baby vines to ensure survival. And after that, they're on their own, and it's off to the races. And these vines are about 30 years old and have an estimated 40 to 50 feet of vertical roots underneath. They're going to die trying to find what they'll never find. 80 meters down, or 250 feet, is the natural water table. But the end result, combined with 13% alcohol and no oak, is that this lighter southern Italian red has, again, a real sense of terroir. You get dusty red brick and heaps of tobacco spice afforded by the iron-rich, non-volcanic soils of Puglia. In terms of food pairing, because we're quasi-coastal, if you need a red to pair with both seafood and meat, look no further. A bite of cipino is going to be just as delicious in this case as a little bit of lamb. Grazie mille, ci sentiamo dopo, and ciao for now.